Kenny Chesney gets to live that dream every day. The contemporary country singer is a star who gradually rose through hard work, persistence, and creativity. Often described as a free spirit, the music mogul wears his fame very lightly and is somewhat a private person. With over 30 million albums sold worldwide, Chesney is also one of the most successful crossover country artists of his time. Oftentimes, success in the music industry translates to a very fat wallet. According to estimates online, Chesney's net worth is around $200 million. But how does he spend all this money? From going to vacations to charity donations, allow us to show you how one of your all-time greats spends his millions. Cycling Chesney has got the means, and so if he likes something, then he will completely throw himself into it. Most money bags would prefer horse racing or any other type of activity associated with the high class. But Chesney decided to try something different. In 2010, he revealed in an interview that he really got into cycling and he just didn't stop at buying himself a bike. The singer said that he bought all kinds of cycling equipment, which proved to be a great tool to help him in his personal life. Chesney reportedly became obsessed with biking for a while after he split from his ex in 2005 as it helped him take his mind off things. Going on Vacations Chesney previously lived in Tennessee before he decided to sell his magnificent mansion. He, however, loves nothing more than going on vacation and mostly to the Caribbean. His fans are called the No Shoes Nation after the title of his biggest album, and Chesney likes to live that lifestyle. When he's not on tour or in the recording studio, you can most likely find Kenny Chesney kicking back on the beach with his shoes off. He loves adventure sports and spends as much time having fun on the water as he does relaxing on the sand. And at the end of the year, Chesney goes for vacation, but this time not for his own enjoyment. He also takes his staff plus their family members and pays for everything. His crew is flown to the Virgin Islands for a week after which their boss caters for all expenses. Chesney says it's something he's been doing since 2002, and it's definitely one of the many perks that comes from working with a star. Real Estate Chesney is known to be a real estate investor who doesn't shy off when it comes to spending money on palatial property he falls in love with. For example, in 2010, he reportedly paid a heart-thumping $9.25 million for an 11,143-square-foot mansion and 30-acre property in Franklin, Tennessee. He also shelled out $755,000 for an adjoining property that brought his property to a total of 56 acres. According to real estate websites, the lavish gated property was built in 2008 and boasts two garages with parking spots for 10 vehicles. Additionally, the property features a helipad, a private pond, and a billiard room. The Mediterranean-style villa also includes first-class amenities such as a zero-entry swimming pool, a home theater, a home gym, and an elevator. The four-bedroom, nine-bathroom home was originally listed for $13.9 million. However, it appears he settled for less as it sat on the market for several months. Chesney also owned several homes in St. John in the Virgin Islands, and a home rumored to belong to him was sold for $4.752 million in 2007. Charity Chesney has generously used much of his massive wealth towards a variety of charities. The singer generously gives some of his money away to charity to help improve the lives of others less fortunate than himself. Some of the lucky charities are the ACM Lifting Lives, Kids Wish Network, and National Parks Conservation Association. Let's look at them briefly starting with ACM Lifting Lives. ACM Lifting Lives is the philanthropic arm of the Academy of Country Music dedicated to improving lives through the power of music. Each year, ACM Lifting Lives provides grants to music therapy and music education programs. Other activities include serving members of the country music community who face unexpected medical or financial hardship through the Diane Holcomb Emergency Relief Fund and partnering with artists to improve lives through music. Kids Wish Network This is mainly involved in infusing hope, creating happy memories, and improving the quality of life for children. Kids Wish Network assists children with their families through several key programs which honor and comfort brave children and families who are going through difficult times. National Parks Conservation Association Founded in 1919, the nonpartisan, nonprofit National Parks Conservation Association is the leading voice of the American people in protecting and enhancing the national park system. NPCA, its 340,000 members and partners work together to protect the park systems and preserve America's natural, historical, and cultural heritage for children and grandchildren. Cars and Vehicles Chesney is known to roll in style. He has a mad collection of top rides and high-end cars. He usually goes for comfort and functionality. Ferraris and Bentleys are some of his favorites. 
But apart from cars for transport and show up, Chesney also owns agricultural vehicles. He famously sang about his tractor in one of his many hit country songs from his back catalog. The star wasn't just making up the fact that he owns a tractor, and in fact, he actually owns two of the agricultural vehicles. While he might have sang only one song about one of his tractors, Chesney figured people probably wouldn't be okay with too many farming tunes. Instead, he just chooses to drive his second tractor and keep it out of the spotlight, while the other gets all the glory. So yes, he owns a number. Breaking up and finding love The breakup that Chesney chose to hit the road for was when he and Renee Zellweger split up. The couple's marriage only lasted four months before it all ended in tears between the actress and one of America's most respected entertainers. Chesney is also known to keep his love life private, but when he and Zellweger embarked on their whirlwind romance, it was impossible to keep it quiet. The couple was spotted together many times, with the actress even showing up to one of Chesney's concerts, but they cited differences as a reason for the divorce. The reunion didn't work out for long, and luckily, Chesney bounced back and quickly and found love in the arms of Miss Tennessee 2005. The singer was spotted with Amy Coley several times on the beaches of the Bahamas and Malibu staying fit. Chesney has been referred to as the fittest man in country, and it only takes one look at him to see why he's been given that title. The singer likes to stay in shape for his concerts and employs a personal trainer to really put him through the paces in the gym. He might have hit 50 years old, but that isn't going to slow Chesney down anytime soon. Chesney's personal trainer, Daniel Mang, has the star on a one-hour workout regimen, which packs everything into 60-minute sessions. Grilled Cheese Sandwiches I know you didn't believe what you just heard, but yes, that's true. Grilled Cheese Sandwiches Most people expect a famous music star with Chesney's fortune to dine out in the most expensive restaurants often, but Chesney prefers to live life at his own pace, and that includes the food he eats. During the week, the country star tends to stick to strict diets to go with his love for working out, but on Sundays, he relaxes his eating rules. The country star's favorite food of all time is a grilled cheese sandwich, and he claims to have written a song about it, so he splashes some cash to get his favorite delicacy. Keeping his life private Most celebrities, and especially those have acquired the fortune as that of Chesney, always prefer to display their life to the public. Chesney is, however, a unique member of that category. Many celebrities can be spotted in fancy cars or amazingly expensive clothes, but not Chesney. While he earns a lot of money and likes to enjoy life, he tends to keep his private life to himself. Romancing It seems there is one thing that Chesney values more than most in his life. While he was reportedly saddened by the split from his ex-wife, Renee Zellweger, it didn't take him too long to move on. Chesney admits to being a free spirit and doesn't like the idea of being tied down for too long. The country star came out and said he had been with over 100 women during his life in the aftermath of his divorce from Zellweger, and it's obvious that in all those scenarios, money must be involved. Otherwise, that brings us to the end of this video, and we hope you enjoyed it. And just be sure to subscribe to our channel for more of our awesome content. And please, give us a like and share the video. And don't forget to turn on the notification bell for timely updates of our new uploads. We value your feedback, so feel free to share your thoughts with us in the comment section down below. And see you in the next video. Bye!